It's called Operation Gila Monster. Border crossers weaving their way through the desert at night with drugs on their backs. But this MCSO squad is trying to make sure potentially millions worth of those drugs never make it to valley streets. As the sun goes down on the desert, crime comes to life under cover of darkness. And so does this Maricopa County Sheriff's Office Special Ops Squad. On quads. On foot, scouts on ridgetops armed with night vision and GPS spotting smugglers miles away. Bigger groups, they'll split up when they get closer to I-8. Trying to stay ahead of drug runners doing the same thing to dodge the deputies. Would uh, stun people on how sophisticated they are. Plus, eyes on the roads, watching, waiting. Once we get back here, we'll turn the, off the light. Suddenly, 515 Victor. Intel puts us hot on a trail. Sheriff's office. Packer stuff in here like hardcore. They've been here. This was it. A drop spot for packers, as in packing 50 to 70 pound drug blocks on their backs. This car is obviously running on. Sometimes the pickup is in plain sight, waiting along highways you take to San Diego and Rocky Point. So blatant. They'll be sitting right on the side of the road. This truck stopped dead in its tracks, hiding eight men and stacks of drugs. We got 401 pounds of marijuana. This guy made it 75 miles past the border. Carpet shoes hiding his tracks, but no match for night optics. He's busted. Plus another 200 pounds and another 250 pounds. There's 350 more. Still just the tip of the iceberg. Most people don't realize how much drugs are coming over and the actual impact it's having on the state of Arizona. Until Operation Gila Monster can bite into more bad guys. Along for the ride, Noheilani Graf, ABC 15 News.